From this video, we're going to be making a digital elevation model or DEM in short, which is a raster file which contains the elevation of a certain place. So, uh, first we're going to be making the DEM using the Google Earth Pro and then an uh, additional website. And uh, we're going to be doing it in, uh, I'm going to divide the video into different parts so it's easy for you to understand and to take it all in. So the first part, in the first part we're just going to be making a KML file using Google Earth Pro. Okay, so I'm here at Google Earth Pro and the digital elevation model I'm going to be making it for West Virginia. So I'm here at West Virginia, I just did a search here and we are here at West Virginia. Now what we're going to do is we're going to use the add path option here. There you go. Okay. So we're going to name it. Let's name it DEM for W Ver. Okay. Now we have style and color. It doesn't really matter since it's going to be path. So what we're going to do is we're going to take some paths around West Virginia. So Let's take as many points as possible. So I'm going to click it and then drag it. So I'll have many points as you can see. I'm going to do a zigzag here to take as much value as possible around West Virginia, including West Virginia. Okay. I've just clicked on it and I'm dragging the cursor around. If I drag it too fast, as you can see, the points are more spread out, but that's not what I want. I want more and more points. Okay, that was a mistake. Looks like I have to do it again. So let's do it again. I'll, I'll give the name later, because it's heavy work. So let's do it carefully. We, we want as many points as possible, because the points are going to represent uh, different elevations of the place, the coordinates, the points hold. The more points you take, the more value you have, you have for elevation and more accurate the elevation model is going to be. So please be patient here with me or if you want you can just fast forward the video or increase the video speed to 2x. Now I'm getting impatient, but you should not get impatient. The more patience you have, the more great your model is going to be. So we have done the zigzag in this direction, now I'm going about this direction. So there we go. Now let's name it DEM. Oh, come on, DEM for WVIR. Okay, there we go. Description. Uh, do we want a description? No, we don't want a description. Just click on OK. And now we have done it. Here we have our camel file. Do right click on it and save plus S. Save the camel file. 
or the gmz file here in my gmo folder i'm for saving it as dem for wbir click on save and let's do it again yes so it has been saved so that was it for this part in the next part we're going to see uh, the next part <laughs> okay so thank you very much for watching i hope you got to learn something new and please go forward to the next video thank you if you have found the video to be useful please like and consider subscribing to the channel as it will enable me to make more videos like this one thank you